We are in the year 1944, several years and two wars ago. The Allies had invaded the continent. Victory in Europe was still six months away. This is a rest area somewhere behind the lines in France, where the Red Cross and the Army tried to make life pleasant for the GIs who were just too worn out to take any more pounding for a while. About to enter this Red Cross canteen are Sergeant Eddie and a few buddies from his platoon. They want a last brief look at a place without gunfire because in a few hours, they will be moving back to rejoin their company at the front. Uh, well, we've had a couple of nice weeks, man. Yeah, great. I had a ball. 14 days in a rest area, 12 of them in the hospital. <laughs> now, John, boy, you should have been in Paris with us instead. We got no rest, but memories. <laughs> oh, brother. Lay off, wise guy. <laughs> Better luck next war, buddy. Let me tell you, next time I'm really going to have a... Hey. I want to spell that. Hello. Say hello to me, baby, in any language, and you're just asking for trouble. Easy, John boy. Easy. 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 Battle party game? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Serenade this chick for me, we side. With pleasure, John. Oh, look at her, ain't she pretty? Oh, look at her, she's a beauty. Look at the hair, look at the curls, look at the teeth, look at the pearls. Oh, look at there, ain't she pretty? She looks like a beautiful wax doll. And you are bound to fall. I like the dress, I like the hose, I like the hat, I like the pose. Oh, look at there, ain't she pretty? She looks like a beautiful wax doll. And you are bound to fall. I like the dress, I like the hose, I like the hat, I like the pose. Oh, look at there, ain't she pretty? Number 13, right down here in the corner. Too bad she had to pick a sailor. Eddie! Oh, I thought you'd already gone. No, 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 no. Sir, uh, <clears throat> ma'am. Eddie, stop it. This is your last night here. And, well, can't you break down a little? Well, there's nothing I like better, but you know, enlisted man, and there's a silver bar, regulations, you know. One of these days, Sergeant, I'm going to give you an order. And that do make it nice. How you fellas doing? Very well, Major. Very well. Say, you're those singing fellas from the 4th Infantry, aren't you? Yes, sir. That's right. Well, how about giving us a good old cavalry tune? Hey, Eddie, the Major wants to hear a cavalry tune. Sure thing. By the way, Major, here's a fine singing lieutenant to help us out. Women lieutenants. Well, you can't block progress, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Let's have it, fellas. Round her neck, she wore a yellow ribbon. She wore it in the winter and the merry month of May. When I asked her why the yellow ribbon, she said it's for my lover who is far, far away. Far away, far away, far away, far away. She said it's for my lover who is far, far away. Far away, far away, far away, far away. She said it's for my lover who is far, far away. Johnny. He wasn't sure her heart was pure, her eyes were far too bold. So round her neck, he tied a yellow ribbon. He tied a yellow ribbon cause it matched her hair of gold. Hair of gold, hair of gold, hair of gold, hair of gold. Hair of gold. He tied a yellow ribbon cause it matched her hair of gold. Give her chance, you 
spy this lovely maiden, and by her side there walks with pride a Johnny strong and gay. And round her neck there is a yellow ribbon. No matter how you love her, please stay far, far away. Far away, far away, far away, far away. No matter how you love her, please stay far, far away. Far away, far away. Her love is for another, so stay far, far away. I certainly enjoy that. <laughs> you know, it almost makes up for that slaughter I went through. <laughs> well, I'm going to bed. Good night, Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Lieutenant? Yes, sir. You're a doll. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I understand you uh, jokers are in Paris, right? We, oui, we. Oui. Now, was it just like this? Only all the time and everywhere and lots more of them. <laughs> it's how you say... Ooh la la. See bon. See bon. See bon. Say, say, see bon. See bon. See bon. Lovers say that in prayer. See bon. See bon. When they speak of romance. See bon. See bon. It means that it's so good. Hey, say, see bon. See bon. See bon. So I say it to you. See bon. Like the French people do Say si bon Because it's all so good Every word Every sigh Every kiss dear Leads to only one thought And it's this dear Say si bon Nothing else can replace Slightest embrace Say si bon And if you only would Be my own For the rest of my day I will whisper this phrase My darling say si bon Si bon, si bon I mean that it's so good Si bon, si bon When I say say si bon I think you're going to get away like that. What'd you find out, John boy? I have an amazing lifeline. <laughs> be good, good, good to me, and I'll be good, good, good to you. When others try to date you, resist with all your might, and I'll tear up my little black book and see you every night. Don't wander in the moonlight with anyone but me, and I won't sit with anyone else beneath the apple tree. Be good, good, good to me, and I'll be good, good, good to you. Give me all your and I'll give mine to you Don't go out with anyone else I'll tell the boys I'm through Be good, good, good to me And I'll be good, good, good to you Stay close to me, my darling I'll stay close to you When you see Mabel, Sally and Sue Just tell them to lose I'll tell Tom, Dick and Harry That I'm gonna be true to you and when it's time for wedding chimes, I'll say I do, I do. Be good, good, good to me, and I'll be good, good, good to you. Give me all your kisses, and I'll give mine to you. Don't go out with anyone else, I'll tell the boys I'm true. Be good, good, good to me, and I'll be goody, goody, good, good. I promise. No days to lay off the armistice. Ha! Uh, our, uh, Sarge, you better shake it up. We got transportation in ten minutes. Yes, you. Well, can't you just stay? Lieutenant, somebody will hear you.
Good night, sweetheart. Well, it's time to go. Good night, sweetheart. Well, it's time to go. I hate to leave you, but I really must say good night, sweetheart. Good night. Good night, sweetheart. Well, it's time to go. Good night, sweetheart. Well, it's time to go. I hate to leave you, but I really must say good night, sweetheart. Good night. Well, the captain and the colonel won't like it if I stay too late. So I'll say goodbye to you, baby, until we have another date. Good night, sweetheart. Well, it's time to go. Good night, sweetheart. Well, it's time to go. I hate to leave you, but I really must say good night, sweetheart. Good night. That's it, Sergeant. Yes, Sergeant. Here. What's on your mind? Well, you know us going back to the lines the way we are. I I just got to thinking about another fellow who went back to the lines over a year ago on the other side of the world. He was a shy kid, quiet kid. Come from Green Springs, Ohio. I never met him, but I just got to thinking about him just now. I understand I'm not running down the Major's horse cavalry, but if you want to really write history about this war, I suspect you got to Build some kind of dirty halo around the real hero, a guy named 745, the infantry rifleman. Oh, they've got no time for glory in the infantry. Oh, they've got no use for praises loudly sung. But in every soldier's heart in all the infantry, Shines a name, shines a name of Roger Young. Shines a name, Roger Young. Born and died for the men he marched among. To the everlasting glory of the infantry lives the story of Private Roger Young. It was he who drew the fire of the enemy That a company of men might live to fight And before the deadly fire of the enemy Stood the man, stood the man we hail tonight Stood the man Like the everlasting courage of the infantry Was the courage of Private Roger Young On the island of New Georgia in the Solomons Stands a simple wooden cross alone to tell that beneath the silent coral of the Solomons sleeps a man, sleeps a man remembered well. Sleeps a man, Roger Young, born and died for the men he marched among. To the everlasting glory of the infantry Lives the story of Private Roger Young 
Well, vacation's over, men. You ready to go back? Yeah. Well, take off. All right. Well, take off. Well, happily, this will be a short trip. We'll be back to reality and the present after you listen to this important message.